G'day guys, welcome back to the SUP build. Aaron here, uh, this is episode three and thanks for tuning in. Uh, I want to say a big thanks to all the people that have uh, followed and liked uh, my video so far. Um, keep it up please, thank you. In this episode, I'm going to reveal the plans, which is very exciting, uh, and tell you guys how to download them. And then we're going to use the plans to mark out and cut the hull sides and the hull panels. So it's pretty exciting. Uh, let's do it. All right guys, here's the plans. So what I'm gonna do is take you through them, explain exactly what you're looking at on each of the five sheets. It's a really simple plan. All the instructions that um, you know, come with the plans are actually you know, in the YouTube video. So if you download them, um, you know, go back to the start if you haven't already and watch the, the series from the start. I'll take you through you know, joining the two plywood pieces together via scarf joint and just follow the process from there. So on sheet one, Page one of five, you can see the, the nesting diagram. On the next page, just some, some dim, simple diagrams, a wireframe diagram, what the SUP will look like, uh, a view from the front and a view from the side. From there, we've got sheet three, and this is our distance between our, our frames. So starting from the bow, you can see frame one, two, three, all the way through to frame 11 and the transom. And then we've got our frame plotting measurements. So this is a really simple process to using the corner of the, the plywood to measure across is the first number and then measure up. So in this example, we've got the transom, 210 millimeters by zero millimeters. So we go, if this was the corner of the plywood, 210 millimeters across and then mark uh, an X at that position. And then we go to our next one, 198 by 62. So we got 198 across and then 62 up, make a mark. And we go through, we do all our positions and then we connect all the lines and there's our frames, really simple. You see all the, all the plotting measurements there in millimeters for all the frames. And then we have sheet five or five and these are the, the keel and the hull side plotting measurements. So our keel, really simple, and our hull side and you'll see in, in these two plotting dimensions that there's sheet A and sheet B because it's obviously going to be longer than one sheet. We're gonna have our sheets joined together and it's just um, going through the numbers again. You know, 16 millimeters by 389. So 16 across, 389 millimeters up, mark our X on our plywood. Going through from sheet A and then sheet B and then back to sheet A. And then you'll see then the shape of the keel take place in front of you, and then the same with the hull sides. So, pretty exciting guys. Five sheets, uh, available for, for free download. So, let's talk about how to do that. All right guys, downloading the plans. It's really simple. As I mentioned at the very start of my series, I don't wanna create a, uh, a design business selling plans. I just happened to you know, design something that I thought was pretty cool and I wanna share it with the world. Um, all I ask is that if you want the plans, to shoot me an email uh, using the address in the video description uh, and then subscribe to the channel, like the video, send me a screenshot, show that you've done it and that's it, really simple. Um, and what I would also love is that if you have any questions on the plans uh, or on the video process, is to just chuck some comments down below and include them in there so that other people can learn from you know, your questions and we can create a real com you know, community around you know, building this particular stand-up paddleboard. So really simple. As I said, subscribe to the channels, like the videos, shoot me an email, screenshot it, and then I'll reply back you know, almost you know, straight away if I'm awake. Uh, and then you get the plans. You'll get exactly what you know, I took you through right here. All the sheets, all the dimensions, and then you just have to keep watching the, uh, the video series to learn how to build this up. That's it. All right, guys, let's, uh, let's get into it. So you can see a mark here, and another one here, and another one here. And it's quite a simple matter of, of measuring out from the end. You know, so in this example, it's, it's 232 mils in, and I think it was about 50 mils up. So you measure across, measure up, and mark your X. 
And once you've done them all, it's just a simple case of mark them all out and then connect the dots. Alright guys, it's the next day, doing the final touch up with some 60 grit sandpaper on my hand sander. Next step is marking out the two bottom panels for the hull. <laughs> Yeah, buddy, slippers can go in the garage. Alright guys, thanks for watching episode 3, I hope you're enjoying the series, don't forget if you haven't already, 
subscribe, thumbs up. If you've got any comments or questions, shoot them uh, to me via the comment section down below and uh, send me an email with a screenshot and you'll get the plans and you can follow along and hopefully build your own. Um, and I'll see you next episode where here's a little sneak preview. All right, see you next time.